Argentina. Well, oh, how dearly they would love a little try before half time. It could come from this. Oh, brilliant running from Rodriguez. He's gone the whole way and caught England napping, perhaps resting on their laurels momentarily. And the l clever little touches in that build up were memorable. And it's another brilliant try. And what a time to score it. Ignacio Rodriguez Muedra. Well, he's making his name today, is he not just? It's the chip kick that worked, wasn't it? Um, from a man that was so inspirational. So the first try scorer, Moyano. And look at that, the ever present Rodriguez. We mentioned that he would have to have an impact. This is where he caught it in the dummy. Wade took it. And then just the strength and the tackle of Clegg gets Argentina in for their third try. Wales looking to come off the back with Morgan Allen. Just gets up over the... Well, that ball there you can now dive on because it's inside the end goal area. New Zealanders weren't aware of it. And this is not a good person to kick the ball to. Severe. Just going one way, then the other, then looking to link up. He'll go all the way. This is try number six. Julian Severe, the top try scorer here in Argentina. Oh, that was too easy. Now towards the right-hand flank, that's White. Taumua who made the initial break. Now second man play, getting it to Coleman. Coleman looking to see through, and that's exactly what he's going to do. What a second try. The man that set up the first, Robbie Coleman, he's all class. It's his third try at the Junior World Championships. And the man that has played Super 14 rugby, he was part of the team that were beaten by South Africa last year, has scored Australia's second. Look at that, the second man play by Taumua. The dummy, and then he stepped on the inside of Prop. Bruma Batenhorst, well, prop on second five, it's not a contest. You tell your boys after the hit, just hold as well, okay? Can you ask him that for me, please? Well, it's odds on the Trans Tasman battle for the final at the moment, certainly with Australia there. It looks as though their dear old friends from across the water will be there to challenge and defend their title again. So it's Blayendal. We're into the, just into the last quarter of the match. And this is Blayendal, and this is three points, and that's the norm. Love the way that he kept his hand, head down as well, followed through, planted the foot that needed to be there with the left foot. 